Hey, it's John, your favorite tank car foamer. Got a couple tank cars in this box from Atlas. Let's go to the workbench and take a look. All right, so here's what we're looking at today. These are HO scale 17,360 gallon chlorine tank cars from Atlas. As I mentioned, these tank cars are in Atlas's Master Series. And I counted six different decorated versions on the website. The decorated versions go for $44.95 each. And it's also available in an undecorated version for $36.95. I have one here that's lettered for HOKX and one that's lettered for GATX. We'll take a look at the HOKX one, which is in front here, first. Okay, so I've taken a close look at all the paint and markings on this model and found it all to be outstanding. Everything on this car that's printed is legible with magnification. Even the tiniest writing in this little grid over here, down in here, it's all legible. And something else you can see from the side here, which we'll take a closer look at when we look at the bottom, is the uh, brake rigging down in here. Taking a look at the brake end, you can see that the brake wheel is a separately applied piece. And looking a little bit closer here at the brake wheel detail, you can see that there's also a chain down in here. So it's not just a separately applied brake wheel, but it's a separately applied brake wheel with chain detail this handrail is to scale. This is actually molded plastic, but it looks almost as good as photo etched material to me. You can also see separately applied grabs on each side of this. And looking from this angle, you can see that the placard holder is a separately applied piece, and then this is an Accumate knuckle coupler that's attached to the body. And I wanted to point out on the A end, well, first of all, on the side here, you can see a separately applied placard holder here. There's some brake reservoir detail here. And then otherwise, it's similar detail with an Accumate knuckle coupler body mounted. Nicely done. Looking at the hatch detail, you can see it's a nicely done hatch. And the plastic railing and everything is very durable. And then of course here we have a little walkway, which is also molded plastic. It's finely rendered enough that if you weren't paying attention or if you add some weathering to this, it'll look as good as a metal etched piece. Resting the car on its side here to show you the underside detail, you can see all the brake rigging underneath. And these are 100 ton roller bearing trucks. And if you look, you can see that these are in fact body mounted Accumate knuckle couplers. All right, and looking at the GATX model in a reverse order that we just looked at the other one, you can see that it's the same details 100 ton trucks. They're metal wheels. I think you can tell from looking at the video here. The detail around the hatch is also similar to the other model we were just looking at. For molded plastic, this looks really good. And looking at the AN, you can see similar detail, separately applied placard holders, very thin metal grab, and the extra brake detail here, air reservoir. And once more with the brake end, separately applied brake wheel and chain detail, super thin wire grab going across and you know something really cool about this and I just noticed a minute ago is that it's a painted halfway up see how it's black down here and it's white up here that's a cool touch I like that so all right and back out to the wide view and something I should mention that I failed to mention on the gray car is that the safety bars down here are actually metal so they're going to be very durable very good this is another really solid release from Atlas. Both of these cars had perfect paint jobs. And the most remarkable part about the markings was how legible everything was, even as small as it was, especially on that gray car. That little grid on the right side of the car was all legible. 
And I had to magnify it a lot to see all that. So great job, Atlas. I like the separately applied placard holders. I mean, just it's just a solid, solid release, and I can't wait for more. Good job, Atlas. I'll see you next time.